Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome to our YouTube channel. Oh, today we're gonna to show you this home behind me, but first of all, I wanna tell you where we are. We're in Sunbridge, which is a brand new community that very few people know about. It's gonna be three times the size of Lake Nona. It's gonna go from the St. Cloud area all the way up past the 528. And it's got some major, major plans. So if you are thinking about like buying in Laureate Park, but want to buy at the beginning of the market, Sunbridge is the place to be because this is that beginning of the market. They're putting in highways, they're putting in schools, they're putting in shopping. So very, very large opportunities here to do really well as far as investments in homes. So the home behind me is a David Weekly home. We don't have pricing on it yet, but we want to give you a preview of it. Um, it is a three bedroom, two and a half bath home. It's got a three car tandem garage. It does come with a base as a two car garage. Um, and it has an amazing primary bedroom that's up through that window there. We'll show you that at, uh, once we get upstairs. You have to wait to see it. It's an amazing, it, like it took my breath away when I went up there. I wasn't expecting it uh, when I saw it. It's just an absolutely gorgeous bedroom. So um, it is 2,309 square feet of living so come on up let's go ahead and do it uh this one here if you're familiar with Laurier Park David Weekly had a red house like this as well at Laurier Park called the Reef which was an amazing house as well um, but they like to do this they have some nice brickwork here in the front as well and of course all this wood paneling around with the red with this really beautiful door here now behind the door is Jasmine she's new to our team uh this is her second time doing a video so we're going to let her go ahead and take a tour of the first floor and show you everything down here come on in all right, so I want to show you what you see when you first come in. You're going to have your office space. I love what they've done in here with the wood paneling. The blue just kind of gives you an idea of what you can do with this room and what you can do um, with your office space if you need that. Um, I love this table and how they've just decorated in here. They really do a good job of accenting um, the rooms and kind of giving you an idea of what you can do. So. Um, over here, we have your little uh, coat closet. When you come in, you can put your shoes, your coats, everything. And we're gonna go into half bath downstairs. Great. Over. Um, and then we're gonna go this way into the kitchen. Now, I love this kitchen. Uh, I love what they've done with the backsplash here. It just, again, gives you an idea. So as you see, this isn't an, a gourmet kitchen, but you can put a gourmet kitchen in here. Um, so this is kind of standard, what you can get in this kitchen. I love the color combination that they did in here. It's a little different than what we normally see. You normally see like a white, you know, you do white on top, white on bottom, but what they've done here is they've done the white on the top and the white on the, and the brown on the bottom. And I love that. It's a really cool kind of new modern way of doing a kitchen and, um, so let's go over into this little area. This is, you can put a table in here. I love this table actually. It looks kind of metal, kind of like that rustic look. So look at this cute little wine rack that they put over here. I, again, I love how they decorated in here. Let's see what kind of wine they got. Pinot Noir, gotta love it, some Pinot Noir. All right, let's go over here. So you have your living area. Again, they've put more wood paneling on this wall, which I kind of love. Like they just putting these little accents on the wall just to give you an idea of what you can do in this home. Um, I love that feature. Let's go over this way. So right now this is part of their office, but this is typically a two car garage. You can make it a three car tandem garage. Um, let's go outside. So this is going to be your green space out here. This is a, um, a rear entry garage. So this is going to be your little green space area. Look what they've done over here with the, uh, the flowers. I just love this. This is so cute. It's again, they're coming up with these modern ideas to um, decorate the home. So again, this is your outdoor living space. You have two, two car garage. It can be a three tandem garage. And so let's come back in here and hand it over to Mike. All right, thanks Jasmine. So I also want to introduce you to Jonathan. Jonathan does our Spanish channel, Casas Nuevas. Mm -hmm. uh, so if you are interested in watching any of these houses in Spanish, make sure you check that out. We'll put the link below as well. So did you show them the pantry here, the Harry Potter I didn't room? actually. So they have a really nice uh, room here where they have, where you can like, you know, hang your coats and stuff, but they have tons of work. Look how much work they have down here. They're expecting a lot of people. They said they have 1200 people come through here already. They haven't even grand opened yet. So 
um, definitely really cool. So let's go ahead and go upstairs. Now, if you are looking to buy or sell it anywhere in the Central Florida area, make sure you give us a call. Phone number is 407-487-3030. And we'll have the Spanish number below too if you want to call and talk to someone that speaks Spanish, we could do that too. So here we are upstairs. Now what's really cool is they have this really nice railing going around. That would be an upgrade. And then we come here to the second floor. Nice wood flooring going throughout, some carpet in some areas as well. There's a loft behind me. We'll show you that in a little bit, but let's go ahead and go down this way. This is a air handler. Um, and then we'll go to the bedroom. So this is bedroom number two. So as we come in here, nice size bedroom here. We have a couple end tables and they've done some really cool uh, paint going around to make that two-tone. The closet is right behind and that's a really nice closet. It has the pull-out doors, a little bit better than the sliding doors that you see in most places. Now we come here, we leave this carpet back into the wood flooring and then we go over to bedroom number three. Now bedroom number three, they made it into an exercise room. So they even have this bar here. I've never done this. Ugh. So anyway, I definitely don't do ballet. I do, I'm trying to get to the gym every day and lose some weight and do some cardio, but yeah, I've never used that sort of thing before. But anyway, let's go this way. And we have a full bathroom. So this is nice. We have the sink here. They probably have an option where you can put two sinks if you wanted to, it's definitely enough space. Toilet behind us. And then of course your bathtub. And they have a really nice, I like how they have this tile work in between these grays with this like nice light blue tile work here as well. So that's beautiful. So let's go ahead and go down this hallway um, and show you what else we have down here. So here's the little loft area where you can sit and enjoy some games. So this is nice. Like if the parents wanted to watch like the living dead or something downstairs and the kids wanted to play with like SpongeBob or something up here, they can do that. So you have those two little different spaces. Do people still watch SpongeBob? Yeah, they do. Probably, yeah. So, um, and then of course we do have the laundry room. We have some nice tile work here on the floor, which is nice for the laundry room, your washer, your dryer. And then of course we have a little um, area over here where you can do the folding. So wash, dry, fold, all in one place. Isn't that neat? So, and we're talking about the primary bedroom, right? Outside I was talking about the primary bedroom. Well, that's down here. Oh, there's a door here. This is probably a towel. Yeah, this is a linen closet just for your towels. But here's the primary bedroom suite. Tell me that this doesn't like wow you. I mean, the rest of the house is really, really nice too, but this bedroom is just, it just feels really cool with the, the, how the vaulted ceilings go up into the ceiling a nice light fixture here. And then how they have the window up there as well. And then these really nice picture windows here, bringing in all this natural light. And then they had this wood paneling going all the way along with the two windows on either side. And of course your king size bed with the uh, end tables on either side. We have a nice walk-in closet here. You know, and they, they did do a nice job here with actually adding some stuff for um, your shoes and stuff like that. But of course you can customize the closet as well if you wanted to, but this is for wire racking. This is a really nice closet. And then if we go this direction, we go, we move back into tile and then we go into Haley's trying to hide from the camera. There you go, I got you. Um, anyway, so here is the actual bathroom. Um, the tile work in the actual um, shower, if you look at it, we have some hexagon tiles that are like the light gray. And then as you come up, they have the darker gray tiles going all the way up to the ceiling. We have two shower heads. We have one, the traditional shower head over here, and then we have one above you as well. And then of course we go into the bathroom area. We have the sinks. Um, and of course all the drawers here. So you can have, you know, makeup stuff here. If you wanted to put a little mirror here, uh, behind this door is the water closet. And then of course we have the second closet. So this one does have two, you come through here and here's a second closet. So you have the dual closets as well. This one has a nice window in it. So you can wave at your neighbors while you're in the closet. So anyway, that's it. Let's go back this direction and go back to the loft section. And well, yeah, so nice loft section here too. So that is this home. So all thank you for watching. If you are interested in buying, make sure you contact us. Also like and subscribe to our channel, whether you like to buy a house or just like looking at cool houses. So thank you all. Talk to you all next time. Bye-bye.